Alberto at the Best Top Marketing Team. We just picked up his brand new Ford Raptor and it's already fitted up with our new product, Power Boards. That's what we're going to show you now. So what is a Power Board? Well, a Power Board is an electronic running board. When you open the door, the step comes down, you close the door, the step goes up. It also works with the rear door. So the power boards hide up underneath your truck when the door is closed to give you that ground clearance you need, but as soon as you open the door, they come right down to a comfortable stepping height, allowing easy entry into your truck. So we already installed the power boards on this truck behind us here, and this is not an installation video, but we just wanted to give you an idea of what comes in the kit when you order a power board. Starts off with two of the full length running boards, six and a quarter inches wide and very heavily textured. You're going to get four linkage arms, two for each side. Two of these motors. You're going to get a complete light kit. You have two lights for each board. The control module, which is the brains behind the entire thing. All the hardware you need. And all the wiring that's included as well. So everything you need comes in that one box. The motor control module goes close to the battery. It varies depending on your truck, which side the battery's on, but it always goes next to the battery. On the Chevy here, it's connected on this strut. The wiring harness is a fused system, all built in, and in fact, it's all one wiring harness. Once you run the wiring from the hood down through the wheel wells, you're going to need to connect it to your doors. Now, we're not really trying to show you exactly how to do that. In some applications, you need to remove your door panels, and on most four-door applications, there's a little kick plate right here you're going to need to lift up to get to some wires. Like we said, you get four of these cast aluminum ally arms. What these do is drop the board up to six inches down and two inches out to give you a comfortable stepping height. These will attach differently on every single truck, again, installation guide. But the neat thing with trucks these days is that they're all made for running boards. So there's a place on every single truck where these attach, and it's always bolt in. We don't need them on this truck, but if you've got one of those lifted trucks with giant tires, we make it an extension arm so you can drop your power board down even further. One of the neat things about power boards is they come with these integrated light kits. These are LEDs, so they're not really ever going to burn out. Already pre-wired and fits into the integrated wiring. You can't see these out in the bright sunshine, but at night they puddle the light exactly where you need to step. It's a very neat feature. 99% of the time, your doors are closed get the lines that you want. That 1% of the time when the doors are open, you get the step exactly where you need it. And then we've got some built-in safety features so that even if you shut the door when it's down, it'll stay there if you've got a foot on it. So you're not going to get anybody's foot trapped in these boards. Power boards support up to 600 pounds per side, so that's enough weight for two big guys to carry quite a bit of heavy stuff with them. Power boards are designed to stand up to all sorts of weather. In fact, we give them a three-year, 36,000 mile warranty but we've tested them to last a lot longer than that. And to show you how the testing works on these motors and boards, we're gonna go over and talk to Dick Essek, who's the head engineer on this project. He's gonna show you some salt spray testing, some other stuff that he's been doing in his lab. This is our automated power board cycle test fixture. These particular links have been cycled over 250,000 times. Seven times a day for 10 years would be equivalent to 50,000 cycles, so this is well over 10 years of normal use. This is our salt fog cabinet. Uh, it's an accelerated, corrosive environment. Uh, we use it to test the durability of our products and the platings on the components. Uh, we also use it to ensure our products meet the OE standards. We also test aftermarket products in it as well. We, we test it beyond the OE standards to failure, just to see where the weak points are in, in our components. Our boards have been in there for six weeks. Uh, which is equivalent to over 10 years of the corrosive environment. I'll plug it in to demonstrate that it still works. If you want to find out more about Best Top Power Boards, just go to besttop.com. You can also go to the Where to Buy page on our website and see our list of best top truck authorized dealers who can help you out and help you with your installation.